Welcome back to Triple R. Today I'm taking a look at one of the best side-scrolling beat-em-ups of all time. This game is Final Fight, so in my opinion, it is one of the best side-scrollers. Final Fight came out in 1989. It was published by Capcom. This game created some iconic characters that would make their way into later Capcom titles. Final Fight takes place in Metro City, which is said to be a city within the Street Fighter universe. So who knows, maybe that's where those two guys are fighting at <clears throat> at the start of the Street Fighter 2 arcade game. Uh, the heroes of the story are three heroic vigilantes who are fighting against the gangs of Metro City. The main gang is the Mad Gear Gang. Uh, they also have some characters that made their way into the later Street Fighters, such as Rolinto and Saddam. So let's take a look at these heroes. First up we have Hagar, a former pro wrestler who has become mayor of Metro City and plans on cleaning up the city. And in doing so, he gains the attention of the Mad Gear Gang, who try to bribe him. When that doesn't work, they kidnap his daughter Jessica. Then Hagar tells Cody, another playable character, who is the boyfriend of Jessica. Cody's friend Guy joins the two in their fight against the Mad Gear Gang. Hagar, armed with massive strength, pro wrestling know-how, is a one-man wrecking machine. Cody is a street tough guy who also is very handy with a blade, as his character can hold on to knives in the game for a while, versus the other characters who automatically throw them when you pick them up and hit attack. And Guy, a fast attacking ninja who has fists of fury. So these three hit the streets, it's time to punch, kick, elbow, uppercut, spin kick, suplex, drop kick, splash, and pile drive their way to save Jessica. As for gameplay, each character has their own style, even though it's just a one button attack. There's a nice variety of animations for each. Cody is primarily punch and uppercut, along with his ability to use knives. Guy is a fast attacking character with Fist of Fury, that's like a backhand, that's really a back fist, it's really fast. Hagar has a number of pro wrestling moves. Suplex, Splash, Dropkick, and the Pile Driver. Uh, they all have a super that will cost them some life. So, hit attack and jump at the same time. They all do a variety of a spin. Hagar has like a spinning lariat. And then Cody and Guy both have spin kicks. So, that will clear like when you're surrounded by uh, enemies. You'll do that. To, it'll cost you some life, but sometimes you have to do it. So I have mentioned knives, you will find also you'll be able to use steel pipes and samurai sword during the journey through Metro City. As far as bad guys go, Metro City has quite a few. Some of them have strong resemblance to people in real life, like the giant Andor, who looks like an in shape Andre the Giant. There's also a guy named Axel, who looks, looks like his favorite band, it's probably Guns N' Roses. So you'll encounter all these characters as you continue to walk right <laughs> down the streets. Subways, underground wrestling rings, and parks of Metro City until you come face to face with the boss of each stage. Uh, bosses start with Damned, who is one of the people you see during the intro cutscene. And then you have Saddam, a dual samurai sword wielding boss. You have Eddie, a corrupt cop. Rolinto, a former Red Beret armed with a baton and grenades. And then you have Abigail, a very big, strong boss character. You will eventually end up fighting facing Belgar, the leader of the Mad Gear gang, who has Jessica hostage. He is armed with like an automatic crossbow, but they're all pretty fun boss fights. Uh, they have their, their cheapness. Eddie has a, a gun which he shoots, the crossbow is a pain. You, you have to avoid those attacks. Uh, it's not overwhelmingly bad as far as cheapness. It's just there to like steal quarters back in the day. But you still can get through it. It's a lot of fun. <clears throat> like I said, in my opinion, one of the best sites really beat them up of all time. Uh, you're going to like Final Fight. There's a character that you're probably going to like to play more than others, but they're all a lot of fun. Cody's fun uh, for his knife aspect. Guy's fast. And Hagar, if you're a pro wrestling fan, you're going to like playing Hagar for the pile driver, drop kicks, uh, suplexes, and stuff like that. Uh, the other two have a sh over the shoulder throw where they throw people into enemies. Game is a lot of fun. I give Final Fight. A 9 out of 10. Thanks for watching Triple R. Have a good day or night, wherever you are.